afternoon, everybody. This is Karen Martz and Freedom the Parrot. So Freedom is in his travel cage, and now we're going to transition to his bath perch. So I'm going to undo this little drawbridge. All right, Freedom, do you want to come out? Okay, good boy. Freedom, do you want to step up? He's like, let me get my bearings here. Hi, Freedom. Okay, who's going to do a bird bath? Okay, good boy. Okay, I want you guys to see this. I hope my veterinarian will see this because Freedom does step up for me. Okay, Freedom, go on to your bath perch. Good boy. See, I've got him trained like a dog. Right, Freedom? Yay. And then this is what we're using. So this is just a simple plant sprayer. Right, Freedom? And I got this perch right here uh, from Foster's and Smith. I also order from uh, Great Companions. All right, Freedom, here we go. Here's our bath. Yay. So it's really important. Freedom went to the vet last week. And birds really optimally, can I use that word, uh, should have a bath at least once a week. Right, Freedom? All right, so I have to switch hands. Barely have the strength to hold the iPad, right, Freedom? <laughs> Whoa, plus do, do our spraying at the same time. Good boy! Freedom, let me see your pretty wings. All right, we're going to switch back. So, now look what, look how, what a, I don't know if the light can show on this. Freedom has a fabulous sheen on his feathers. Hey, Freedom! And normally, um, you know, you might see this on, on ducks that have to be super waterproof, especially if it's a diving duck. But it's surprising to see it on a parrot. Sort of iridescent. Oh, Freedom, look at your beautiful feathers. Look how pretty. Let's look at our wing feathers, Freedom. All right, we're going to spray the stomach. Watch your... Okay, here we go. Look how beautiful, Freedom. Look how pretty. And he'll, he'll bring his wings forward and protect his little nose. Hey, Freedom. Which are called the nerves. Hey, Freedom. All right, Freedom, let's see the beautiful tail feathers. Okay, we can do this without, without dropping the machine, right? Here we go. Okay, Freedom, let's look. Look how beautiful. Who's a pretty boy? <gasps> Freedom, you're such a pretty boy. So now, Freedom has a tendency to get dust in his nares. So you got to be careful. Um, hey, Freedom. And a lot of times he'll walk over. Oh, look at these beautiful feathers here. So he's fully fledged now. He should have... 12 um, tail feathers, and then I say this all the time. Hey, Freedom, who's got pretty bird feathers? He's got the red shoulders, so I call them Christmas shoulders for red and green. Hey, Freedom, so silly. Freedom, are you going to climb the walls? So what he'll do is he'll move his beak back and forth um, up against the tile sometimes just to get water out of his nose, his nares. I should use proper terminology. Hey, Freedom. Hey, Freedom, look how pretty you are. Who's a good boy? Look how dynamic. Um, so it's really fun to see when your bird is flighted, um, they have a different attitude, you know, um, I have, Freedom has two different vets up in Charleston, exotic vet care, and they will tell you that if your bird is flighted, he's going to have a different attitude, uh, which may not always be good, right Freedom, but he is a dynamic flyer, he doesn't fly a lot, here we go, he's going to watch, he'll probably wipe his beak. Freedom, are you going to wipe your beak out? Hey, pretty boy, look how pretty. So, now right now, just for the video, I'm spraying, you know, on top, but I'm going to get... Oh, sorry, Freedom, I just ran into the travel cage. Woo! Now see how he tucked his feathers in really tight. Okay, Freedom, this is a beautiful bird. Oh, and what's funny is he'll snap his wings open. Here, let's try to get on level. Freedom, look at your beautiful feathers. Look how pretty. You gonna shake your tail feathers? All right, so we'll we'll finish out in a minute. Right, here we go, Freedom. Show off those feathers. Woo! Yeah. So the whole point of a bath, though, don't think I'm doing this for just the heck of it. Uh, it gets the dust out. If the birds were to pick up a mite, you know, Freedom does go with me. Um, oh, there's a water. Um, out in the, in like, you know, May, June, July when it's warm out, we can we can walk outdoors, which is really fun. They could pick up a bug on their feathers or whatever, but they, I mean, they preen their feathers every single day. But they just have to have the water um, to help fix their feathers and also for their skin so their skin doesn't get dried out. All right, we're going to sign off live. Freedom, look at the camera. Hi, beautiful boy. Hey, Freedom. Who's my favorite parrot? Say hi to everybody. Okay, Freedom, we're signing off live from Hilton Head Island, South Carolina. Have a great day.